Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel Pisces Soul Tribe, what's going on you guys? Um, hopefully this message finds you in good favor And that you are doing well on your journey If you feel you aren't, my intention of course is to grab a word from the divine To help you to continue to move forward on your journey um, Pisces Soul Tribe, I want to get into a general read for you guys And of course anything that you need from me can be found down below in the description box so we're still in pisces um season um happy birthday to all the pisces um out there um once again i hope you guys are um enjoying um this season and i hope you all are well um thank you guys so much for the birthday wishes and um well wishes as well um it was pretty peaceful you guys like I, it was very still um very quiet um i was able to gather my thoughts and you know, it's the time for me to, like, reflect and recollect. But, yeah, it was very peaceful, you guys. So, I want to see what's going on with the people surrounding you, Pisces. <clears throat> I feel like there can be um, possible hidden motives. Um, not necessarily um, bad. Um, but I feel like spirit at this present time is going to reveal what needs to be revealed. As long as it doesn't violate. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm gonna grab some messages from What's the Tea just to catch a vibe, and then we'll get into some tarot, you guys. Okay. So, Spirit, what messages do we have most important surrounding the people around Pisces? Okay. So, talking shit did flip over as well as bad reputation. So, um, bad reputation and talking shit. I feel like somebody here, of course, like the card says, has a bad rep because of just simply being who you are. I feel like you're um, a whole lot different amongst a lot of other people. I feel like you're the type where while others drink, you don't drink. You just choose to um, smoke. Um, <laughs> not mad at you. Um, but like, I feel like these people, these are people um, possibly talking um, bad about you. And this, I feel like this is definitely something that's d being done behind your back because to, in order to have a bad reputation, um, that would have had to have been some gossip um, going on unless this is a... Because like, I feel like what you consider your reputation to be the things that you possibly do are normal. I feel like in the environment that you're in, what you consider normal um, is po possibly a bad thing to other people. And like, I feel like these are people who, who talk, you know, who talk about you like that in that way I'm gonna uh, put those both together <clears throat> so what else okay okay so it did come out anyway so um so okay so um creeping as well as love um on the brain um dreaming fantasizing daydreaming um nostalgic I feel like somebody has you on their mind Pisces which is why um this is coming up and like I feel like this is definitely something that someone's doing behind the scenes. This is definitely on the low. I do feel like um it's possible that people are watching your social media accounts or someone someone very specific, someone that you could have um had a special bond with. Um I'm not necessarily like feeling like a core relationship. Uh, it could have definitely been a relationship. Take the message as it resonates um with how deep it may possibly go. Um I feel like somebody's definitely thinking about you. I feel like um, at this present time is just think, um, thinking, just thoughts, um, dreaming, fantasizing, daydreaming, nostalgic. Like um, I'm definitely getting um, six of cups energy. I'm not necessarily feeling like any bad vibes from this. I just feel like there's possible that there has been a disconnection um, and it could have been um, mutual. Um, yeah. So I feel like this is someone who's possibly just thinking about you. Let's see what else is going on. What is this? Um, no facts, never has the facts, makes shit up, lies. Yeah, so somebody's definitely lying um, in your energy. What else is going on, Spirit? <clears throat> so, um, fake flexing. Um, X rich, flosses money, X fancy, um, shows off. Uh, this could be you, um, Pisces. Um, it could definitely be another energy as well. Um, I don't really see you, seeing you like really um, outwardly, shall we say, faking it till you make it. I feel like um, this is also a mask because I like I'm not necessarily just getting, you know, flosses and money. I'm getting I'm getting fake flexing, being fake, period. Um, I feel like maybe things aren't the best. Maybe things aren't so good. 
But like, I feel like maybe it's possible that you're the type um, that would never let anybody see you sweat is also what I'm feeling. Um, same shit, different day um, is at the bottom of the deck. So that's also why I'm feeling it in a sense as well. But let's see um, what's going on in the tarot. So I'm going to use the Lightworkers tarot deck today. I feel like there's something that really needs to be made clear. Um, some form of clarity, no hiding um, of the truth, especially um, if it's harmful. Spirit, why is bad reputation and talking shit important? Clear, please. Okay, three of cups. And the five of coins. Okay. So three of, <clears throat> excuse me, three of cups and then the five of coins. I feel like there was once a point in time, because like I'm not feeling like it's like really heavy um, present energy. I feel like if someone is has been um, been on the struggle bus, you're li literally at the tail end of things like being real different. You even feel different. Um, your some of your circumstances are beginning to change as well. But I'm feeling at one point in time, I feel like there was a, a group of people that someone was connected to. I feel like you're no longer connected to those people because uh, it is possible that your intuition or something very deeply vested in you let you know that somebody was talking shit about you, possibly how you were down and out. Um, how you were a little low, um, how things weren't really on your favor, how you possibly were on the struggle bus. Um, I feel like this is um, things that people um, commune amongst um, possibly right before you got to um, right before you got to events. Um, I also feel like this is something that people discussed um, behind your back um, as well while you were away, possibly at um, a party. I feel like this that this definitely happened at a party for someone and you overheard them talking shit about you, especially with the Queen of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Um, I feel like you're 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 somewhat a, a, a very masterful person of um, communication. I feel like you pay attention to pay attention to body language. Somebody feel um reads energy well is um somebody reads energy very well. Like very well. Um you're the, also the type of individual where if someone was talking about you, you can feel the feel the energy and you will also know it. What's this five um three of cups and five of coins? Okay. Yeah, so the high priestess um and the hangman. I feel like this is something you knew about, but I definitely feel like this is something you did not speak up about it um, at that present moment. <sighs> Excuse me, you all. Um, I feel like this is definitely something that someone held on to. I feel like you 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 saw after some perspective to see what you needed to do about this as well. I feel like you also saw higher counsel being your spirit team, spirit guides, God, um, whoever you deem <clears throat> God in essence. Um, yeah, definitely. So I feel like you, you know about it. You knew about it. And like, I felt these people, these people, these friends, these, these friends, these, these persons that you were connected to seven of coins, as well as the moon, they, they definitely feel like it's still hidden. They definitely feel like you don't know. Um, they're also still lying about you to present day. Um, high priestess and the hangman. It wanted to hide. Yeah. So the Queen of Swords in reverse. Yeah. So um. So Queen Queen of Swords in reverse. Most people would like in this in this particular moment. I feel like while you could probably rip somebody to shreds, I feel like while you could rip multiple people to shreds, I feel like you're you're thinking about how you feel. I'm also getting um Queen of Cups energy as well. Someone's um, thinking about things, how you feel about things before you react with the moon at the bottom of, of the deck. Like there's definitely um, holding back at this time. I feel like what people don't understand about you, Pisces, is you're a master of illusion. So you're 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 good at finding what's hidden, what's not true. It just presents itself to you. Um, what else? With this Queen of Swords in reverse. Yeah. So Knight of Coins.
I feel like um, Pisces, you you no longer find something attractive. Like this is it, I, like I feel like something's no longer um, appealing to you about this group of people, and like I feel like that's what you took the time to like really truly think about how you really feel um, about these people and how possibly at the at this moment. What you thought was appealing about these people, what you did find attractive about these people, what you did like about these people has literally flipped in reverse. With the Ten of Swords at the bottom um, of the deck, like I feel like there was definitely um, surprising endings to a lot of people. And like these are people who know why with the seven of um seven of swords um at the bottom of the deck. Like these were people who are lying behind your back and honestly um wearing a mask in front of you. And they did it repetitively. Yep, they did it repetitively. And honestly, I feel like they did it without eat what without a thought. With no regard to how um anybody else would feel about the um particular situ um situation. Um, what, <clears throat> excuse me, you guys. Um, what's creeping? Okay, so the death. So definitely somebody creeping in your energy where there has been an ending, and it was a necessary one. Um, I feel like before you end a lot of things, Pisces, like really truly end a lot of things, you consider the value of it. Um, and like I feel like in order for the death to be here, I also feel like this was something that was needed in order for you to change. Um, in order for you to um keep on going. Um, death. So someone um very um, much so on the low. Why are they on the low? Um, so with the ace of coins, this is someone um that you ended a cycle with, is what I'm hearing. Um, I feel like someone is now seeing some form of, of of success with you. I feel like this is also someone watching you um get your flowers. Um, <clears throat> I feel like this is also someone who possibly feels like you get a lot of attention um, as well. A lot of offerings. And like, I feel like this person wants to put their bid in again before it's too late is what I'm feeling. But like, I feel like this is also somebody who, who possibly caused some major damage. Because in order, as I said, in order for you to be creeping, like you either blocked um Pisces ain't fucking with you like that or you just have no stay like I feel like somebody's just literally um in in no regard at this present time especially with the six of cups showing itself this is definitely somebody who's been thinking about you and somebody who now wants to give to you I feel like this is somebody who previously was not giving to you and I'm not even necessarily saying that they're, that they're, that they're, um, that they were only taking. I feel like this is somebody who didn't give, give what was important. Like the, the emotions, the feelings, the attraction, the appeal. And like, I feel like once upon a time it was there, but something, something is not aligned or wasn't aligned, which caused an ending. Um, Ace of Coins. So yeah. Um, with the Hierophant, this is someone who wants to offer a serious form of commitment to you. Um, I feel like this is somebody at this present time who's viewing you as very, as I said, very attractive. I feel like this is also someone who knows that you're attracting a lot of things your way. Um, not even necessarily suitors, but um, opportunities, um, prospects to like really truly ground yourself, um, different forms of stability as well. I also feel like adversely without putting anybody else into the equation, I feel like something is about to happen for you, Pisces, because of some ending um, that you place, um, some faith that you put in um, your spirit team. Almost like a um, like the justice, like like some form of karma. Um, yeah, with the tower at the bottom of the deck, like because of some painful transition, like because of a, a, a lot of changes, I feel like something like while while I was um, pre shuffling, I, I kept on hearing something is do you. Um, so maybe something like with the eight of eight of wands, um, like I feel like something um, possibly is on its way moving towards you as well. What is this higher front? Why is the higher front present? <laughs> So the judgment, um, some some earned reward, like some form of 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 karma. 
I feel like there was a lot of things um, that happened in a lot of places and a lot of areas that was important to you, Pisces. And like, I feel like there was a lot of point in times where, as I said, you could have annihilated a group of people. You could have annihilated multiple people, but I feel like somebody remained silent. Um, there was a knowing that someone needed to just, um, yeah, be quiet. Like, and not say anything. Um, think about what's more important to you. Think about what you what you what you want to attract. Think about how you view relationships. Um, and like, and I, I feel like this has caused you to be in a place where maybe you don't know. But like, I do feel like something definitely is about to surprise and shock someone because of a lot of pain, a lot of pain. What else? After the judgment, what do we have? Um, so King of Swords. Why the King of Swords? So Knight of Swords. I feel like something's quickly income um quickly coming your way. Some form of balance as well. I'm definitely feeling the justice here as well. I feel like something's also going in your favor as well. Maybe a possible court case. Yeah, something's coming in quick. So two of swords. I feel like an, um, an opportunity is about to present itself to you. Uh, a decision, a choice. Like you're going to have to make a choice. And I feel like it's going to stir up a lot of conflict with a lot of people is what I'm is what I'm feeling. But like, I feel like this is something that you need to consider more than that. And like, I feel like there was also a point in time where you would consider everybody else's feelings before your own. I feel like don't do that. I feel like you aren't doing that. But um, if that is a place that you are struggling with, um, I would say let that thing go. What's this to a source lastly? <clears throat> so eight of wands um something's moving in quickly an opportunity a conversation is also what i'm hearing some form of download something to possibly change your life is also what i'm feeling um will of fortune at the bottom of the deck i feel like just something is really truly truly coming in to start to work out in your favor to present you opportunities that will benefit you um versus humble you Love on the brain. Hmm. So that's interesting. We have the two of coins. We have the page of swords in reverse. And then we have the page of cups um, upright. So two of coins. So two of coins. Page of swords. In reverse. And then we have the page of um, cups. I feel like um, at this present moment, there is somebody who honestly has some misinformation um, about you. And like, I feel like this is somebody who's also possibly trying to connect the dots um, when it comes to you. To definitely see um, what benefits you. Um, how they also should um, approach you um, as well. Um, what else, Spirit? Let me do that again. What else? So, Ace of Wands. I feel like this is someone who, versus a logical approach, they're taking a more heart-driven approach is what I'm feeling. I feel like this is also somebody who's like ready, set, go. I feel like this is also somebody who's waiting for the moment where they could um, just take off. Um, I feel like somebody's waiting for an opportunity to like really, truly go. But like, I feel like this opportunity is also presenting themselves. I feel like somebody wants to approach you with a lot of passion as well. Um, what else? <laughs> with the sun um, upright, like. This is somebody who honestly um, has some form of clarity as well. I feel like this is someone, as I say, who's leading with a lot of passion. This is a lot of fire. Um, could possibly um, be a Leo as well. 
Um, what I'm hearing, what I'm hearing is invigorating. Is what I'm hearing. Somebody finds someone very invigorating. There's this sense of happiness as well. Some form of joy. Um, what else? I'm hearing you are my sunshine. So that's interesting. We have the seven of wands in reverse, and then we have the six of cups um, in reverse. Okay. I feel like this is somebody um, adversely who is lost in a memory. Like, I feel like this is somebody who's stuck um, in the past. I also feel like for you, Pisces, um, something about the past has really truly enlightened you. I feel like at one point in time where um, there was a lot of de a lot of determination about something, I feel like there was a, a moment where you lost some faith, lost some courage, possibly um, in some past or previous dynamic. I feel like you're moving on from that space. I feel like it was a very manipulative, manipulative space as well. Yeah, with the Seven of Swords. Um, there was a lot of deceit, a lot of lies is what I'm hearing. Okay, where's, where's Pisces moving from this point, last few? So Five of Wands, there's some form of conflict with what somebody wants to bring to you. Some other offer again. I feel like it doesn't align. I feel like while you're moving forward, someone is... Is stuck in the past And like I feel like this is where they should stay Stay lost over there <laughs> Um fake flexing Mm hmm Yep That's interesting Um so the tower as well As the king of coins Um I feel like somebody is Getting ready to lose a lot In your energy Pisces I feel like, yeah, this is definitely somebody who, who who's losing a lot. I feel like this is somebody who's also wearing a mask. Somebody's lying here. What else? Yep. So the moon, there is an illusion here. Um, somebody's lying about what they have. Um, Eight of Cups. Um, definitely um, So somebody walked away from somebody um, Here as well is what I'm hearing I feel like somebody's Lying about having a partner still I feel like somebody's also lying about How much money they have um, Somebody's definitely going through some, 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 some real tough transitions right here The moon Yep some form of um, Temperance as well um, As the nine of wands Somebody's struggling I feel like somebody's really, really struggling to balance reality. That's what I'm hearing. Um, somebody's living in a, in a in a in a fantasy world. I feel like somebody's also stressed out too. Stressed out with keeping up a lie. Is what I'm hearing. Somebody's stressed out with keeping this this type of behavior. Um, up. what else? So Queen of Cups and the Empress. But I feel like some form of change is also um, on the way. Um, I feel like it is going to take some time. Um, I'm hearing the number nine. I'm also seeing the number nine. Um, somebody could be pregnant um, at this present time. Like maybe you just like literally just found out or you're getting ready to find out that you're pregnant. I feel like you also need to extend yourself some grace as well. I feel like a lot of changes and a lot of transitions are rough. I'm also feeling adversely someone needs to keep um, these sudden changes to yourself um, self as well. I feel like secrecy um, at this present time or what is hidden is very important. I feel like somebody's also possibly stressed out that you are pregnant and you've possibly feeling like you may have to do this on your own. 
I feel like this may also be a little shocking. What else? Yeah, so four of cups. I feel like someone may be um, wanting to give this up. Why? Okay. Number nine. Nine of cups. I feel like this is a blessing. I feel like while somebody may consider it a curse, I'm not telling anybody what to do. Um... I'm pro-choice. That I I know some people may not like it, but I'm I'll say that out, out loud, um, and I understand um, adversely as well. But I'm I'm pro-choice. I, I don't feel like anybody should have the right to tell you what to do with your body. That's just my opinion. Um, I feel like somebody. Nine of cups. Before I speak. So, um, Knight of Wands, I feel like somebody is possibly feeling like um, it may get in the way. I mean, and I did say the number nine is significant, but like, I feel like that's what this is. But like, I've, here's what I feel like. With whatever choice you choose to make, keep it to yourself. It'll, it'll absolve you from a lot of judgments. It'll absolve you from a lot of opinions on um, what you what people feel you should do and how people feel you should move. But okay, um, that was the reading, you guys. Um, it got real heavy at the end day. Um, uh, hopefully, this message resonated with you in some way, shape, form, or fashion. Um, and you were able to take something from it that you can use. Um, Pisces, if there's anything that you need from me, you can find those details down below in the description box. And of course, at 4.30, I'm going to put a link in the community tab. But join me. We're going live, myself, Blue, um, and Michelle, just in support of a little birthday live reading to also bring aware awareness to added forms of um, spirituality um, and seeing how they all work and culminate together. Um, like I said, if there's anything you need from me, you can find those details down below in the description box. And as always, Pisces Soul Tribe, remember to conquer this day. Bye, guys.